As y'all can see, I have a new background. You got it, it ain't no question. Boy, it ain't no one for guessing. No more than emotionally invested. Showing you all my imperfections. Oh, if I let you take me for a minute. Hey y'all, welcome to another video. If you're new here, I'm Courtney. Hey girl, hey. Be sure to comment, like, and subscribe, and tell a friend to tell a friend to come join us, baby. As you can see, I have a new background. Y'all, we're in our new town home. Anyway, y'all, so as y'all can see by the title, this is going to be a empty house tour. I'm so excited to show y'all. Yeah, I didn't even have the lights on. Look at this natural light. Look at this natural light, baby. We got windows and windows for days. But I'm so excited to take y'all along this journey with me as I decorate our new town home. Y'all can let me know once I show y'all everything, what I can add and what I can do in here. Yeah, because when I say we got so much space, we have so much space now. So I'm super excited. Uh, y'all, I'm so happy. But anyway, y'all, uh, it's crazy because when I go back and look at my journal, like, I literally manifested this townhome. The exact layout, the space, the brightness, the lights, down to every detail, I manifested it. And I'm so happy. I'm so glad. But anyway, y'all, uh, I'm not going to hold y'all. I'm not going to keep talking. We're going to get right into the video. Stay tuned. So I'm going to start downstairs first. So when you first come in, I'm going to start at the garage. So we have a huge garage. I gotta find the light. We have a huge garage. I'm gonna turn it around. So this is when you first walk out. Here's my truck. Y'all, it's huge. We got plenty of space in the garage. And then when you walk in the house, you have a mud room right here. And then you turn right. You have a closet, you know, plenty of space. All right, so right off the closet, we have the pamper bathroom, the half bath downstairs, sink, toilet, the basics. Moving on, you have the first like living area downstairs. We're getting our TVs mounted on Tuesday. You have another closet downstairs full of space. And then you have the front door. And then you turn and you go upstairs. So we're finna go to the second floor now. I love the open floor plan concept, how everything just flows together, like the living room, the dining room, and the kitchen. So freaking cute. Like, yes, hosting's about to go crazy in here. I can't wait to have our first little event. So I think we're having a Super Bowl party, but we'll see. Oh, I love these countertops. They're white marble. Like, they're so freaking cute. You know what, we got cabinet space here, here, we got the refrigerator, we have the freezer, more cabinet space on both sides of the refrigerator, we have the pantry, more cabinet space we have a gas stove microwave and i gotta turn this way and then we have a dishwasher deep sink and i can't turn this way because they gotta put the um the blinds up but it's windows it's like a big old window so and we got access of seeing the lake and everything so i can't show y'all that because it's I don't need y'all know what I where I live in. Okay, so right off the kitchen, 
We have another bathroom. Basic bathroom. Alright, and we have the first bedroom that's on the first floor. Pretty big. And we have the closet. The shelves right here and right here. All right, so now that's all that's on the second floor. We're going to go upstairs now. So going up the stairs, as you can see, we got plenty of windows, plenty of natural light. Um, I can't really show y'all out what's outside, but it's beautiful outside. It's a lake and everything. So, um, but we're going to go up the stairs and I can't show y'all out the windows because they once you get upstairs, you have a loft area. This is where we're going to set our desk and everything up. Up here. It has like a little pocket, as you can see. So, it won't be in the floor. It'll be back towards the wall. So, yeah. And I love how this blue... I love this blue wall. It just adds a little accent color in here. So, it's going to be real cute when I put the decor up here for our home office. You have the hot water heater and I'm point of looking in there. And then this is the master bedroom. Huge. And more windows. I love this little pocket right here. I think I want to add a mirror and a chair over there. I haven't. Okay. So right here, once you open up the double doors, you have the bathroom. Yeah, we got the his and her sinks. We got a huge mirror. We got a walk-in shower. And then here is the toilet and a separate. We can close it off. I love that. So we can both be in the bathroom at the same time. And yeah. Okay, right off the bathroom, we have our closets. A lot of closet space, shelves, and then you have the attic, and but ain't nobody going up there. Yeah. <laughs> All right. So right off our closet, we have the washroom, washer and dryer, and it's huge. Lots of space, washer and dryer, and then. It's another door, so like if Katie, anybody want to come in through the other way and not through our closet, then they can come through the hallway. Right off the laundry room, we have Kate's room. So she'll be right across the hall from us on the third floor. Then we have her little bathroom. Just enough cabinet space for her. Too much space ain't good for Kate. <laughs> Then we have her tub, and then her closet is in her bathroom. She got the same shelves as the bathroom, on um, the closet downstairs, and she got space back here. All right, y'all. So as y'all can see, we got plenty of windows in this house. Like they all love the house, so it brings in a lot of natural lights. We also got a lot of lights as well. So even though we got ceiling fans with lights, we also got lights all in the ceiling throughout the house. So either you can use the ceiling fan light or you can use the lights this um the other lights. Also, we have a surround sound in the house. So each room has a speaker in it. So if I want to go downstairs and plug it up, then we can play music throughout the entire house. That's gonna be lit for cleaning days. Like I'm gonna be making announcements. Wake up, wake up. It's time to clean, baby. But yeah, even off our room, we have like a view of like um a lake or whatever. Y'all, so beautiful. I wish I could show y'all, but I don't need y'all pulling up on me. But anyway, y'all, so for the most part, that's the entire house. I'm ready to take y'all on this journey with me as I decorate. Um, they had curtains and stuff up already. 
but I am gonna take them curtains down and add my little touch. I'm glad that rods are all over the house. I don't have to, um, we don't have to put up curtain rods like they already up. So we'll just take theirs down and add our curtains up, the ones that we want up. But yeah, so for the most part, for the most part, <laughs> y'all, I'm tired. Them steps, they gonna be the one to take me out of here. Like, they gonna take me out. But yeah, for the most part, that's everything. I can't wait to take y'all on this journey of decorating my house. I'm so freaking excited. I love how everything is white, it's clean, it give a clean look. So for the most part, we got hardwood all throughout the house. We just don't have hardwood on the third floor, which is okay with me. I don't want hardwood in my bedroom. I want carpet. Like, I don't want to wake up to a cold floor. But yeah, so it's so much space. So much freaking space. But stay tuned for more moving vlogs. Um, so I know y'all can get a deep cleaning vlog as we deep clean. My mom's supposed to be coming over today. So that's going to be in a separate vlog. I get there recorded for y'all. And also just moving and decorating. So stay tuned. And if you want to see more of those videos, be sure to comment, like, and subscribe. And tell a friend to tell a friend to come join us, baby. All right, y'all. I'll see you on the next one. You got it, it ain't a question. Oh, it ain't no one for